Hey guys, what's up? It's once again mp4podcast.com. Today we're taking a look at Cordy for Android. Now, I'm going to be very honest. I didn't think this was probably the most um, amazing game I've ever played. However, it's it's showing p- potential for Android. And that's why I'm showing it off. Now, First off, I have an HT Droid Incredible. Uh, it has a Snapdragon processor. Not one of the best in the world. No, it's not horrible, horrible when games are developed for it. However, um, it runs this game really well. This game looks beautiful. And I've already beat it. And basically what you do is you play this robot, right? And you know, I already opened up this door, but let me give you an example of what you probably had, you had to do. You had to kind of like uh, collect all these stars, and that's like a robot, dog, or whatever it is. You got to come over, collect all this stuff, right? And then you got to um, come over, and then you got to like touch this, um, you know, fuel collector, whatever, uh, space collector. And, you know, it would open up this portal to this other world, like, this other world, kind of. So. Alright. So, basically, what happens is, you end up, um, over here. And then you can go into this door. And we'll go over here. And, you know, it's a... fun game to experience this like for a little bit just to walk through the levels it's a little interesting because right now I really haven't seen an original Android game that looks at this type has this type of quality all right okay so it does have um, this stuff all right so I got collect especially I really have to collect these um these like um, yellow suns whatever they are and I have to go up here, and I have to knock this over. All right, now I got I got to push this, jump up here. Now I got that sun, and you see, it's like really weird. It's like really cool 3D. That's one of the things I do like about this game. I have to make sure I get that. All right, so whatever um, now I can pull oh no I can't I have to, some levels you can pull so let me see if I can get alright so jump up and let me just get that and what you're going to do is you're just going to hit that and see that one was pretty easy And we will continue. Actually, I'm going to play one more level. Alright. So you then you come out. And we'll go into this one. I guess you can just play the levels over again. Alright. Hopefully this one will be a little bit more challenging. All right. Let's go back. Get that. All right. Get that one. And now I can pull this. Go back. Get this one. And. I do want to get those right over there. And there might be some more over here, I think. I have to, like, backtrack, I think. Alright, so no. Alright. Artistically, it does remind me a little bit about Braid. 
But, I mean, it's nowhere on the gameplay of Braid. But, it just, I don't know, it's just, it, it does have a soothing type of gameplay to it. Relax, it's very, it's a very relaxing game. So in that way, it's kind of fun to play, but it's, you know, you know, it's pretty much just a demo. Alright guys, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to put the link to this uh, game in the description box. If you guys want to download it, click on the link in the description box. Or you guys can just um, look for it. It's called Cordy. And it's a pretty, you know, it's a fun game to check out. So that's why I'm recommending it because it's really probably the first uh, Android game that was developed for the Android. Now I know there's some good RPGs. I know there's that RPG, um, the one that's like 15 bucks. I haven't bought it. That, you know, they made some other, actually they made some other, I think it was that company or some another company that made uh, exclusive games for the Android and ported to the iPhone, but it's only one company. This is the only other company, now that I remember, that made something specifically for the iPhone. Now, Dungeons Explorers, yeah, there's some extra levels, you know, for the Tegra chip. But, as far as I know, this is not on the iPhone. And I do think you guys should check it out. Because the graphics are pretty damn good on this game. And, you know, I don't know if the developer optimized for, uh, you know, Snapdragon. Because, you know, but... It runs really good on this Snapdragon, so I'm pretty impressed with it. Even though there isn't a lot of things on the screen happening at one time, it is it does it, it is a pretty good game um, from that standpoint because it does show the potential of you know what Android can do. So check it out, you know, show some love for Android. Maybe it'll help get some other developers to jump on Android. You know, maybe we'll, we'll get EA bring out games the same time that they do for iPhone and so on. So once again, guys, this is mp4podcast.com, and tune in tomorrow for another app review. Take care, guys. Bye. Oh, and uh, give me a thumbs up and leave a comment. <laughs> if you, have, you guys have anything to say, let me know. Take care, guys. Bye.